you grab a copy of the bold paper daily nation reality check clash between new police not new policies and prevailing situation with the initial strategy seemingly failing to tame runaway fuel cost president ruto's administration has been forced to restore the compensation to oil dealers to cushion consumers from higher pump prices but to navigate the political backlash after condemnation of subsidies officials have another name for the intervention even as traders are set to be squeezed further let's just see some of the details that have been put here uh, if we may just go through them blow by blow first on the fuel under pressure on fuel under pressure of rising pump prices now the government is forced to intervene but insist the relief is stabilization not the subsidy officials had discred discredited right whatever that is we'll also get more information is it sta sa subsidy or it is stabilization no it's a matter of semantics also on the economy ceos downgrade their business outlook this quarter as pressure from new taxes and toxic political politics dampens the optimism felt three months ago also mitumba importers of second-hand clothes should breast for a 25 percent duty on imported garments as government seeks to revive the textile industry and promote local products remember also this was a cut the pieces uh, a major one a flashpoint during the campaign period on housing levy kra says all regular cash allowances including car and travel packs will be factored in gross pay when calculating an employee's monthly deduction. So this is more pain for the employees. It will not just be, it will be on your gross that now this housing living will be also deducted. And on power, no respite for households and businesses facing a 1.7% increment in electricity bills. Out of fuel energy charge rose to 4.46% shillings per unit from 4.02 last month and you can read the rest of the details inside the daily nation this morning still on the front page there Ruto Royla to get report by talks team in 60 days the national assembly will today debate a motion to grant the dialogue between government and opposition statutory force with the senate also set to hold a special sitting next week this is on page four. Remember, Senate is on recess, so they will be recalled for that particular special sitting. And relief for consumers as food prices fall. That is a cyber story there. And Central Bank survey shows prices of main food items have dropped from last month. And the trend will continue this month as production improves with cheap fertilizer. And even the president is very sanguine and optimistic that we are able now to export food. Right? This is what he has been saying and or what he said. You could also pick up a copy of the Parenting Pull-Up Magazine. What's in the name? That's a probing question. And all those details are tucked away inside the Daily Nation today. Windfall for Port staff set to receive 500 million shillings pending bonuses on page 14 of the Daily Nation this morning. This is our looks. Make sure also you grab a copy if it really floats your boat and police to guard coffee factories all the theft that is another story inside the delineation this morning the star half of us